I want to talk about the ongoing question about whether you should sign a confidentiality agreement to get documents. Big companies think they're entitled to keep records that smaller companies would just produce confidential so that the next lawyer can't use it against them. I have a big case against Amazon and they are being really big pains in the butt about keeping things confidential. So here's some techniques. One, they want to meet and confer about the confidentiality agreement. And I said, one, we will do that only after you produce all of the documents that you do not believe are confidential. Because one, that will tell me how f much further I need to go. Right? It also tells me what the company is thinking about as to the scope of confidentiality. Secondly, based on a number of different things that I've been able to find out about this case, I may not sign a confidentiality agreement at all. I may not get any documents that the judge even says is confidential. But you know what? I'm damn well going to ask him about them in open court, in trial, and I have non-confidential copies of stuff, and I'm going to put them on the spot. They are not going to want to do that. So sometimes not agreeing to confidentiality agreements, not agreeing to play ball the way everyone else does, shows the other side that you mean business.